Okay. Okay. Good morning, Free Field Pirates, and welcome back to another amazing episode of FPNN. I'm Ethan. And I'm Isabella. Today is Monday, December 5th, the 68th day of school. Now to Mia for the pledges. Please stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for the Fruitvale Pledge. I can be responsible, respectful, and resourceful with everything I do and say today. Get ready for our Monday Florida History question. Today's question is for K-5. through The number to call on your screen is 50612, and we'll be answering caller number two. Today's question is, what is the highest natural point in Florida? Sorry, you're caller number one. Hello, whose class is this? This is Miss Taylor. I'm going to talk to you Yeah. Mount Nona. All right. Um, do you have the correct answer? Mount Nona. Sorry, the correct answer is Britain Hill. Now to Chef Avery for today's menu. Today we will be having chicken nuggets, hot dog, 1905 salad, baked beans, sweet potato fries, fresh apple, peach cup, assorted 100% fruit juice. R. Thanks, Chef Avery. That sounds delicious. You did a great job. The character strong word for the month of November and December is empathy. Empathy is the ability to understand and connect to the feelings of another person. STEM Fair judging will be tomorrow for 3rd, 4th, and 5th grades. The top 20 winning projects will be announced tomorrow night from 5.30 to 6.30 in the cafeteria. We can't wait to hear from the top 20 winners. The giving tree still has name tags on it. Encourage your parents to take a name or two. Then buy the gifts and bring them back to the school wrapped. This is a great way to show empathy. We are also supporting Cranberry Elementary. The book fair will be here on December 8th, so you can begin to shop on the 9th. Information and flyers will go home with you soon. The book fair will be on campus from December 8th through the 16th. Have fun choosing the book you'd love to read. November and December Student of the Month will be on Friday, December the 9th at 8.45 in the cafeteria. Congratulations to all the pirates who are chosen to represent your class. Yearbooks are on sale for $20. You can order them from LiveTouch. A flyer will be going home for you to place an order through your teacher. Make sure you get one. Happy belated birthday wishes goes out to Miss Kaya. And today is Miss Rack's birthday. If you hear, if, if you see her in the cafeteria, make sure to wish her a merry birthday. Now to Mr. French. Good morning, everyone. There I am. Good morning, everyone. Hope everybody is doing great today. Having a festive time. I was just up in Building 10, second floor, and wow, Candyland has come up there. It was quite a surprise up there. So you get a chance to go up there, kind of take a peek up there. I got my uh, uh, candy cane up there, and it's going through there. So that was a great surprise uh, as we went through today. A couple things that are important today. Uh, we have important things every day, but today is the start of testing for a lot of our kids. So our third graders are testing today. So please make sure you're looking for those signs that say testing, do not disturb. We want to be quiet around those areas and do not enter those areas. Okay. So just, you know, do your best, be quiet, be respectful. We talk about being respectful every single day. Be respectful. Don't go in those areas or if you're around that area, be quiet especially on the playground today. If you're playing, if you have an early time playing in the playground, just make sure to stay away from the windows because they're testing right in that area, okay? So if you can go out in the field a little bit today, it's a beautiful day, make sure you go out in the field today, okay? So it's gonna be a little bumpy, it's our first day and that's okay, so we'll get through it. 
third graders, really nothing to worry about. You'll do fine. Just do your very best. And if there's any bumps in the road, you just go along with it and you'll be fine. Okay. All right. Speaking of bumps in the road, these are good bumps in the road. We talked about Emerald Woods leading. And so I just wanted to highlight five Emerald students that had, they were some of our top point winners. I didn't take the top point winners. I just took some kids that are really high and doing a great job. So Andrea Williams, congratulations. Brandon Hartwell, great job. Aiden Long did an awesome job. Julia Schoenfeld, outstanding. And Skylar Risler. Those are all Emerald students who are leading the way with their team, who is actually leading the way with 2,100 points with Citrine closely behind. They're almost there. So great job, Emerald students, and especially those five and all the Emerald students for doing an outstanding job. Keep up the great work, okay? Keep up the great work. All right, we're going to take our 60 seconds, kind of think about what we need to think about today, especially if we're testing how I need to know what I'm doing, focus. If I need breathing and calming down strategies, I can use that. Think about what you're going to do today for 60 seconds starting right now. All right, everybody, hopefully you thought about what you needed to do. I do have one final announcement that's for teachers. Uh, we do have a lockdown drill today, later today. I just put out an email. It just talks about we have the new four-button system and what to do with that four-button system. So please make sure you check your email on that. That is a new system for us, and so we're kind of – you know, like I said, with testing, we're kind of playing it by ear, and there might be some bumps along the road. So that may happen as well, but I did put out an email. It just talks about how, what button do we use for our lockdown drill, okay? Uh, students, remember, those buttons are only for teachers only. So that's it's not a play. It's not nothing to play around with. It's very, very serious. And so please make sure that is for teachers only, all right? All right, everyone, have an outstanding Monday. As always, the choice is yours. Go get them, third graders. You can do it. Have a great day. Back to the anchors. Thanks, Mr. French. Today is National Soccer Tort Day. Make sure you enjoy this delicious layered tort for dessert tonight. It's a sponge cake layered with jams and chocolate icing. FPNN Club meets today in Miss Kate's classroom. Running Club meets today. Boys Soccer Club meets today with Mr. S out on the soccer field. Thank you for watching another amazing episode of FPNN. I'm Ethan. And I'm Isabella. We can have a marvelous Monday. See you tomorrow. Arg. Ah.